I remember when I first started on the show, I always remember reading those early scripts and hoping that I'd be in a scene with Charlie. Because I grew up watching him and I always wanted to be in a scene with him and when they first came, I loved it. Everybody knows Charlie. And when I first started, I'd go home and everyone was asking me, oh, have you worked with Charlie? And it was like, that was kind of special, you know, to, to, to be on set with him. This huge part of casualty for many, many years. When I first started the show, I was quite nervous. I had this really big scene in recess. And I remember Derek, the governor. I'm thinking, my God, it's actually a big moment. I'm actually next to him when I'm doing this. And then when we finished, he just gave this expression. It was just like, yeah, 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 yeah. And I went, <gasps> I was so excited and so relieved and I thought, you know what, I I'm gonna be I'm gonna be fine. Like everybody's gonna say, I am a musician, so walking into his dressing room is just a playground with all the guitars. So we would chat about music a lot, what he was writing, you'd see him light up when he was telling me what he was recording. Well every day when I work with Derek is my favourite day. To be on set with Derek, knowing uh, that he's such an integral part of the history of this show, uh, makes, uh, makes every time you work with him exciting. My very first day here as reader, it's all full of nerves, I was joining Casualty. He grabs me from the green room, gets his guitar out and he starts singing me all his Irish songs that are like near and dear to his heart, totally calmed me down and I just thought that was so sweet and generous of him. I would say Derek really set the tone for for us as a, you know, as, a, as a cast. He is an everyman. He talks to everyone, cast, crew. He makes no difference in anyone. I mean, aside from what he brings as an actor, I think the, the longevity that he's had on Casualty on this show speaks to his goodness and speaks to a man who has a massive heart. He doesn't just deliver a line because it, it's in his scripts. He likes to know how that's affecting everybody else and, and how we can collectively make the scenes better. And that's why I think his legacy will live on uh, throughout the, the ED for many more years to come. If we can all sort of strive to hit the professionalism that he has with each and every script, then we've, uh, we've got a good future ahead of us. Thirty years, every day a dream.